The Medela Integral Feeding Pump is the optimal solution for continuous or bolus feeds which require a syringe pump option. The compact size, minimal weight, sturdy construction, and safety enteral orange coloration make it the ideal complement to any NICU enteral feeding system. The Medela Enteral Feeding Pump is the only true enteral feeding pump that is designed to be rotated upright to maximize fat delivery as recommended by Aspen, ADA, and Hambana. The enteral feeding pump includes enteral feeding pump and power cord. Rotating pole clamp and accessories are sold separately. The first step is to mount the clamp. Ensure the clamp is positioned so the curved channel is in alignment with the pole. The clamp can be easily mounted to a pole by tightening the screw knob clockwise to capture the clamp in the selected position for use. The second step is to mount the pump to the pole clamp. To mount the pump to the clamp receptacle, ensure you are using the pump handle. Align the locking tabs at a 90 degree angle into position and gently push down on the handle of the pump until it locks into position. You will hear a clicking sound to ensure it is secure. Return the handle to the store position. Finally, to remove the pump, move the handle to the carry position. The pump can easily be removed from the pole clamp. Ensure you are using the handle and then gently push the release button while pulling up on the handle. To turn the pump on, press the power on key. Use the arrow keys to select volume over time, milliliters per hour, or use last setting, then press the enter slash yes key. Ensure you have securely connected the set before loading the syringe on the pump. To load the syringe, squeeze the black clutch lever toward the white tab. Hold the black clutch lever and the white tab tightly together to release the clutch. Slide the syringe driver to the right until it reaches the end of its travel and release the clutch lever. Lift the clear syringe clamp allowing room to place the syringe. Insert the syringe barrel first. Ensure the barrel is placed in the two notches under the clear syringe holder clamp. Then lower the clear syringe clamp. Make sure the syringe finger tabs are held by the metal retaining spring. Pinch and hold together the clutch lever slash tab. Slide the syringe driver to the left until the syringe driver contacts the end of the syringe plunger. Make sure the retaining bars clasp the end of the plunger. The syringe is now properly loaded. Press the enter slash yes key and the syringe size is automatically detected and displayed. Confirm displayed syringe size matches the size that was loaded. Use the number keys to program the volume amount to infuse and press the enter slash yes key. Use the number keys to program feed delivery time in minutes or hours in minutes and press the enter slash yes key. Trace the tubing to the patient to confirm proper connection, then press deliver to start delivery. Once the feeding has started, rotate the pump upright by applying a gentle force in the desired direction. Rotate the pump vertically so that the syringe tip is upright to maximize fat delivery. Once feeding is five minutes from completion, an alternating red-green indicator light will flash. Once feeding is complete, there will be a red flashing indicator light as well as an audible alarm. When the syringe is empty, press the enter slash yes key to continue and remove the syringe. To unload the syringe, first retract the syringe driver by grasping the clutch lever to release the syringe plunger, then lift the clear syringe clamp. Rotate and pull the syringe outward in order to remove the syringe finger tabs from the metal retaining spring. When the pump is not in use, it is recommended to return the syringe driver to the fully inward position, toward the left. The Medela Enteral Feeding Pump has a standby mode feature which allows a standby timer to be programmed with a time delay. The clinician is required to manually press start when the timer alerts. In order to set the standby timer, press the menu button twice after the feed is programmed and select option 5 to set the standby timer. Then program the desired time before you will be prompted to start the feed. If you decide to start early, select the stop button and then deliver in order to start the feed. The Medela Integral Feeding Pump features occlusion detection, an alarm delay function, and will track total volume delivered even if the pump is turned off. When the Medela Integral Feeding Pump detects an occlusion, it will draw slightly back on the plunger. In some cases, this eliminates the occlusion. If not, the pump will alarm to alert the clinician so the occlusion can be resolved. Alarm delay is set for three minutes. This is how long the alarm will stay off before turning on if silenced or if the pump has been set and deliver is not selected. 
The pump will track total volume delivered even if the pump is turned off between feedings. You can easily reset the volume to zero. Before the feed or while paused, push the reset zero button. Then select yes or no. The infusion pump has many customizable settings and additional safety prompts can be activated. The syringe pump has default settings that can be changed by working with Biomed. The pump will allow you to program greater than the volume of one syringe for larger feeds. Simply change the syringe and use the enter and deliver buttons when prompted. Medela recommends leaving the enteral feeding pump plugged in when not in use, except during transport. Tailored to meet the unique needs of neonates and built for the demands of the NICU, because nowhere is the power of human milk more apparent than in the NICU. It's where drops save lives and small details matter.